Hi everyone, it's Mrs. Turnbow, and today we're going to talk about steady beat. Steady beat is like a heartbeat. Sometimes it can be fast, like when you're running really fast. Or sometimes it can be slow, like when you're relaxing, watching a movie, or in your bed asleep. Sometimes it's in the middle when you're just walking around school. But did you notice that it's always the same, right? It never changes. There's never any extra stuff in there. That's because this is the beat. And when there's extra sounds on each heartbeat, that's called rhythm. So let's check. This is the beat. Can you pat with me? Pat or clap it on your lap. Very good. Let's change it to a rhythm. Listen for what's different. You got it. Great job, everybody. All right. Hi, boys and girls. So today we're going to talk some more about tempo. Can you say that word? Tempo. T-E-M-P-O. Tempo means how slow or fast the music is playing. Now, we are going to clap along with this rhythm on the screen here. It's all quarter notes and quarter rests. A quarter note equals one beat. Now, this sign at the end here is a repeat sign, and that simply means we're going to repeat the whole thing when we get to the end. So when we get here, we're going to go all the way back up. So I'm going to start with doing slow first. And we're gonna clap along. And then when we get to the end, we'll go back to the beginning. Let's give it a try. Let's press play. Again. How did you do? Pretty good? Great job. Now, even if you mess up at all, don't worry about it. This is just practice. Okay, you're doing a great job even if you're trying your best. I'm going to switch it to this word fast. And let's compare and see how different this song feels this time. Ready? <gasps> Repeat. Phew, that sure did feel a lot different. How did you do? Do you like the slow version or the fast version? Let me know in the comments. I will see you guys in a second for the next clip. Bye. Hello, boys and girls. Hello, how are you? I am good, thank you. So this little um, clip here is because I need you to go on a little scavenger hunt in the next few days. I would like you to start collecting some things that can be used as instruments while you are at home doing remote learning. So I would like you to collect a water bottle, 
an empty water bottle. Any size, it could be probably a plastic disposable one. Um, some rice or beans to put inside because we're gonna make a shaker. I would like you to get um, a couple pencils or metal spoons to be your rhythm sticks. And I would also love if you could collect a, an old coffee can or a coffee container, something like that, that you could use as a drum. Now, it doesn't have to be right away. Just over the next couple weeks, if you think about it, keep it in your remote learning station because soon we're going to be creating some instruments together so you have something to play at home. Sound good?